If I were to ask you um, to describe your life in one word, most people would say hectic. Stress leads to a very hectic, hectic lifestyle. There are women who are now working full-time jobs and also being full-time mothers, and there are also men who are working multiple jobs just to help their families out. Teens are also finding it hard to um, juggle between school, extracurricular activities, and also a job. They are also in competition with college acceptance and to their favorite schools. It's scary to think about how much stress can really affect our lives and take over. There are a few tips that I came across to help avoid stress. According to WebMD, there are seven easy steps that you can take just to avoid stress. The first way is to manage your time. This helps you determine which things are urgent and which things need to be taken care of. Um, there are some things you may find that you can put off until later. It will make your life easier, less stressful, and way more meaningful. The second is to look at your lifestyle. The choices you make about the way you live affect your lifestyle. Um, your lifestyle on its own may not cause stress. Um, it can prevent your body from going into even more stress, so my friends will not want to hang out with me if I'm very stressed out. <laughs> um, it affects the way it makes me very grouchy <laughs> to where nobody wants to be around me. <laughs> so um, the third way is to find your balance. Find your balance between work, family, and school. I tend to be very bad at that. I try to balance it all at one time. Um, but now that I've learned, you can just, I will do school for a certain amount of hours during the day. I will take time to do my homework. And then, you know, I will go on and hang out with my friends later if there's time. Um, have a sense of purpose in life. It's easier for college students to have a sense of purpose in life because once you set your major, it's something you want to work for and something you want to do. You find your motivation. Um, setting deadlines really helps. Get enough sleep. Your body recovers from stress when you sleep. Um, it's very hard to relieve stress when you're up all night worrying. One thing that I came across, though, was um, to keep a piece of paper and a pencil by your bed or even your cell phone. If there are things that are keeping you up at night, just write them down and vent it out. Um, also, you can make notes if your worries keep you up. What I do is I make notes and like put them by my key so I know I won't forget it. Um, adopt healthy habits. Staying healthy is the best defense against stress. Eating more fruits, vegetables. Um, exercise, simple exercise, just as taking a walk around the block or walking around college campus can help you avoid a lot of stress. Um, it was said by the Mayo Clinic that um, this will boost your feel-good endorphins and make you feel better about yourself just by exercising. Um, in conclusion, there is no substitution for good health. Um, stress affects your lifestyle and the way you live. Um, in today's fast-paced world, we must learn to make time for ourselves. We need to slow down. Research has shown the effects that stress causes on the body, such as heart disease, ulcers, and high blood pressure. Pay attention to what your body is telling you and apply these techniques because you can become physically stronger, mentally clear, and emotionally stable.